This is breaking news now from today's TMJ4. That breaking news is a major police presence tonight on Milwaukee's south side. Parts of a neighborhood are essentially on lockdown after three juveniles were shot there with a high powered pellet gun. Now it's all centered on 35th and Pierce. Our Tom Durian is live nearby Tom. Yeah, we're just down the street at 38th and Pierce where the street is blocked behind me. I'll let you take a look at the remainder of the scene here. We are above the Menominee River Valley and that's the industrial area that's near Miller Park and below the 35th Street Viaduct, which is closed right now at both ends. So take a look down the street here. You can see what remains of the officers here on the scene. Now take a look at some of this video. The MPD tells us around 7 o'clock tonight that the call came in about a person with an unknown weapon. They responded to the scene in force with armored vehicles and lots of officers here tonight. We know that those three juvenile victims were hit and suffered non life threatening wounds from what police are now calling a high powered pellet gun. Now that gun was recovered, but they are still looking for the person responsible for firing the shots uh, back live. Police are, are calling this an active scene. As you can see, these streets that are still shut down, they're asking people to stay out of the area. Canal Street is closed near Miller Park to Miller Street to the east. And as I mentioned, the 35th Street Viaduct is closed as well on both ends and there is a police drone here going up and down the Hank Aaron Trail looking to see possibly if they can find any suspect. Any more information we get, we'll bring it to you here or on TMJ4.com. Reporting live here on the South Side, Tom Durian, today's TMJ4. And pellet guns, most certainly not toys. Tom Durian, thank you.